James, your thoughts at the end of that game? Well, obviously, um, real pleased with the win. You know, five point win after after the break, and obviously been a, would have been a rearranged fixture. There's obviously a little bit of unavailability for us and them, which uh, challenged the the squad a little bit. But I think we are overall so pleased with the result. You obviously knew that Cambridge were missing a few players. Was the danger that you were going to sort of underestimate it? And, and um, but certainly not. We, um, we we knew that they'd be kind of a, a challenging team no matter what, and you know, we, we had a couple of changes ourselves, so we kind of had our own things to worry about. Um, but I thought the lads kind of came through really well and it showed all the good work that the, not just the team has been playing the last few weeks, but the other squad members have been doing and training really well. Um, showed that it yeah, paid off tonight with those guys coming in and playing well. Pack totally dominant, weren't they? Yeah, it was good to see. You know, nice to see a couple of more tries and some scrum pens. So yeah. Uh, they, they certainly worked very hard in the week this week with Harry and we worked hard on the malls and it's paid dividends today. So uh, a five point bonus win moves you up two places in the table. Have you set the players any targets between now and the end of the season? Um, in terms of in terms of league positions and uh, points accumulation, no. Um, there are certainly some performance targets and one of them will definitely be not to give so many penalties away. Um, which is something we've been working on the last few weeks and something we can definitely work on but no, it'll be more performance based goals the next few weeks. Dan Collier, try. He's going to be talking about that for quite a while, isn't he? Yeah, well, a bonus think, point uh, try. Yeah, I think by the time that uh, by the time ten o'clock hits tonight, that'll be more than twenty. It'll be more like forty. But you know, it's great to see the big man striding out. And coaching wise, you seem to have put your mark on this side in the in the time that you've been here. Yeah, I think it was kind of as I said when I first got here. It was kind of the um, the the bits that are the most difficult things to do, which is you know the unity in the squad and how hard they're willing to work for one another that they. They do in spades on their own, so hopefully just some direction has, has kind of helped um, bring that positive to the fore.